Samantha Host. And I'm Mikey Nesbitt. Today is Monday, February 26th, and we're coming at you with another episode of WK Today. Let's take a look at this week's wild winter forecast from Nate. Thanks, guys. Yesterday, a windstorm knocked out power to hundreds of thousands of residents, and we are still feeling the gust this morning. Except the, expect the winds to die down later this afternoon with a chance of a dusting of snow. Tomorrow, the wind should be gone with a high of 23 by Wednesday morning. The snow is back. We are expected to get around 1 to 3 inches in the morning. The snow showers will continue Thursday and Friday. The look for temps to rise to about 35 for Friday. That's all for this week's forecast. Now back to you with the news. If you are a junior female, there is an opportunity to earn some money. The Dr. Gary Bernstein Community Health Clinic is thrilled to offer a scholarship contest to high school junior ladies who have made a difference in their community. Please see Ms. A for more information. The 2019 College and Career Expo will be March 13th. Please mark your calendars to attend this event. Tell your friends, come out, and get up to date on info about after high school. This is a great opportunity that you don't want to miss out on. If you have questions, please see Ms. A. Current sophomore and junior students with a 3.5 GPA are eligible to apply to be members of National Honor Society. Interested students need to pick up an application from Ms. Snow in room 115. Completed applications are due on Wednesday, March 27th. Now let's turn it back to Nate for sports news. Thanks. Today for the captains, girls JV basketball will face Wild Lake Central in the Lakes Valley Conference Tournament. Game starts at 7 at Central. Congrats to senior soccer player Max Nisley as he signed to play four more years of soccer at Finlandia University. The university is in Hancock, Michigan, and Max plans on studying criminal justice. Thanks again for... Thanks again. That's all for sports. Now back to you at the news desk. This took over 100 students to Disney. While there was a lot of fun in the sun, they also got to perform in front of live audiences and attend some amazing workshops. Let's see a look at their fun. which includes broadcasting and newspaper, please stop by 503 during 5th hour or Ms. Swearin's class 415. You can sign up during your pre-enrollment. Well, that's all we have for you today. Once again, I'm Mikey Nesbitt. And I'm Samantha Yost. Have a great rest of your day.